Good morning, Wolfpack. I'm Renee Gonzalez. And I'm Ben Marjat, and today is August 22nd, 2011, and welcome to a brand new school year. And a special welcome to the class of 2015. I hope all of you have a great four years here at CO. Now let's get started with some school news. Clubs and activities announcements. If you are interested in forming a club, please stop by the activities room to pick up a form or visit our website on School Loop to download the forms you need. All continuing clubs, make sure to fill out a petition to continue your club this year on campus. Forms are also online or available in the activities room. All student drivers, please stop by the, the, the vice principal's office and speak to Ms. Lopez about getting a parking permit for the 2011-2012 school year. Make sure to do this soon because parking enforcement begins September 7th. Attention to all AP U.S. History students who have Mr. Garcia Term 2. Come by Mr. Garcia's classroom, HJ7, to pick up your graded summer work. All girls who participated in summer basketball need to turn in their uniforms immediately in Coach Chapin's new room, HN2. For all girls interested in basketball, there is a meeting today during second lunch and right after school also in HN2. This meeting will just be 10 minutes or less and will focus on fall ball information. Attention sophomores, stop by the culinary wing to see Ms. Hogg to vote for your class t-shirt design. Two designs were submitted over the summer and we need your help to choose the best one for the class shirt. The designs are on the window, so tell Ms. Hogg which one you prefer. The Friday before school started, Kasuma Soaks hosted our very first Midnight Madness scrimmage here at Kasuma Soaks. Did you go, Renee? I did. I had a lot of fun. Yeah, me too. Well, let's hear more about it from Theron and Kevin in our first sports segment of the year. Hey there, Wolfpack. I'm Kevin Penfold. And I'm Theron Hollenbeck. And let's get started with some sports. On Friday the 12th, Midnight Madness occurred at Wolfpack Stadium. Both JV and varsity players squared off against each other in a scrimmage to test their skills. Both no score, no winner was determined. On Saturday, August 20th, our COHS football team went against Rio Linda in a scrimmage at Rio Linda. But like Midnight Madness, no scores were taken. And finally, the first game of the year will be at Yuba City on Friday the 26th. Men's soccer is in full swing with three games this week. Today, they have their first scrimmage against Sheldon at 4. And tomorrow, they have another scrimmage against Laguna Creek. The first real men's soccer game of the year will be Friday at home against Rosemont at 5 o'clock. Make sure to be out there to support your soccer team. Well, I'm Kevin, and that's Theron. And we'll see you on Thursday. Thanks, guys, for that sports update. ASB cards, senior packages, senior barbecue, PE clothes, yearbooks, project feasts, and all other items for sale on campus can be purchased in the student store during lunch or in the activities room before or after school. You can also purchase these items online with a credit card via our new web store. It can be found at kasumnasoaks.schoolloop.com slash web store. Congratulations to the 15 students who had their artwork shown for the district office this summer. We have received numerous comments about your fantastic art. ID pictures will be taken today by grade level. Seniors, you took yours in first period. Sophomores, you guys will go in second period. Juniors during third. And finally, freshmen during fourth period. The summer of 2011 was definitely one to remember. I know I did a lot of fun things like go to Hawaii. What did you do, Ben? I had fun just sitting on the beach in LA, but that's enough about us. What did you guys do this summer? Over the summer, I had a national softball tournament, and we placed third out of 102 teams. And I hit two home runs. I went to Tahoe. Over the summer, I did nothing. Over the summer, we went to Disneyland. I ran over the summer. I spent time with my cousin from Texas. I went golfing and fishing, and yeah, that's it. I visited my family in Texas, Florida, and LA. Had some fun, visited friends, went to the movies, and hung out. Over the summer, I went to San Diego and I got to go to Comic Con and the zoo and all of the fun stuff that is in San Diego. Oh, this summer, I performed three dances for my sister's debut. Over the summer, I slept a lot. What I did this summer, I shopped, um, 
just hung out with friends. Over summer, I went swimming and I had soccer and volleyball. This summer, I went to New York and Chicago. Yeah, over the summer, I got my permit and I turned 16. And I went a lot of places. Yeah, same here. Cool. I went to the movies like every weekend, so like like the movies at midnight and stuff. It's pretty chill. Over the summer, I fell in love with New York City. Over the summer, we woke up in a boat. Uh, I had parties, and I went to Giovanni's party, and had my party. Yeah, Giovanni's party. party. Well, consumers had a pretty fun summer. Don't forget, the senior barbecue is this Wednesday. All seniors will report to their first period of class and then to be dismissed to the main gym for an assembly. Please stop by the store, web store, or activities room to purchase your tickets. Tri-tip, chips, ice cream sandwiches will be served, so make sure to be there. Powder puff forms are available on the school website and also in the activities room. Make sure to return your forms as soon as possible to ensure you get the number you want. Juniors and senior girls, we have some amazing jerseys for you guys this year. The cost for seniors and juniors is just $30, and for the underclassmen, $20. See Mr. Harrigan if you have any other questions. Well, that's it for our first show of the year. I'm Ben A. And I'm Renee. Remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. See you guys tomorrow.